Next example of a timer interrupt. This is a driver for a quadcopter motor. What we want is when we're done, have something that can drive a little quadcopter motor like this at different speeds. Full speed, faster, stop. A quadcopter motor is an AC synchronous motor, three phase. It's got the three phases connecting to its power driver. The black and red lines need to be 6 to 12 volts DC. When I connect them up to 6 volts, what it sounds like is this. I'm not connecting it. That DDD is telling you that the voltage is correct. If I connect to 5 volts, which is too low, it makes the air sound. This is the air sound. That beep beep is telling you the voltage is wrong. Fix the voltage. Going back to 6 volts. It's now waiting for a valid command input. The three wires, like right here, the white wire is your data, red wire is power, 5 volts, black wire is ground. I've not connected it to power and ground. The data line, the white wire, it needs a 0.9 millisecond pulse at 50 hertz. When you connect that, The beeping noise tells you that it's waiting for a valid command signal. That's a 50 hertz square wave, the 0.9 millisecond pulse width. If I connect that, that's on RC0. You get this signal. That long beep says the voltage is correct, the 0.9 millisecond 50 hertz pulse is correct, it's on idle mode. If I now give it a longer pulse, 1.3 milliseconds, it starts spinning. 1.4, 1.5, and that just stop. The pulse width determines the speed. Now the way those pulses are generated is using timer 0 and timer 1 interrupts. Timer 0 is called every 50,000 clocks, or 50 milliseconds, 50 hertz. Correction. Make that every... 20 milliseconds, 200,000 clocks. A prescaler of 4 times 50,000 gives you 20 milliseconds, 50 hertz. When timer 0 is called, it sets RC0. It then sets up timer 1 to happen n clocks in the future. That's the 0.9 to 2 milliseconds in the future. When timer 1 kicks in, 0.9 to 2 milliseconds later, it clears RC0. That gives you your pulse width starting on timer 0, ending on timer 1. So in the oscilloscope, this is what you'd see. RC0 is a pulse every 20 milliseconds or 50 hertz, stays on between 0.9 and 2 milliseconds, giving you speed controller for a quadcopter motor.